Welcome everyone to again a new episode. Today we are gonna have a pint of science. Well, what is going on? It's the first time that the Pint of Science is organized in Maastricht. It's a three-day event and scientists from in and out of UM are organizing lectures to talk with you about their research. We have three of UM, UM's own researchers here tonight who we're going to talk with and who we're going to have a pint with. Cheers! talks about the fact that I believe fundamentally that drugs are magic. <laughs> you know you're in the Netherlands, right? I'm it's a Netherlands dangerous and I'm thing talking to, to students, But what I mean by that is that I feel like yeah. if you have back pain, right? Yeah. You take... Popping my mom's fumovos like yeah, there's no you, tomorrow. You, you pop ibuprofen like there's no tomorrow, right? Absolutely. And your whole entire body is flooded with that stuff. Yeah. But the pain's in your back or in your knee. Yeah. So what about if we could target those conditions by actually delivering the medication locally to that part of your body and having them being released over very many months of time so that you don't need to take pills every day. Can you quickly show off your, your, your shirt because I absolutely love it. Chemistry isn't magic. I think all science, all, all technology at a, at a most abstract level is, is magical. What do you think is the difficulty in teaching science or getting people to be interested in science? I think it really varies. I come from the UK and in the UK they have a huge shortage of physicists, for instance. But actually I think since having moved to the Netherlands, the Netherlands seems to put a lot more money into the sciences and there's a lot more work, a lot more industry. If you look at we, what we scientists do is that we're very much engrailed in uh, the detail of our science. But what we often forget is how important it is to communicate what we do, what we learn, to others, to a broader audience. We want to share our enthusiasm for science. I mean, science is so much fun, and this is a great platform to show how much fun we have doing science and how relevant it is to society. I think that's why this kind of event is really important, to get science into the general public and actually make them aware that there are bigger issues at stake and that they have the responsibility for the future. And it's a wrap. We have wrapped up for today. We have showed you three incredible scientists. We have showed you their work. They're out there having their pint of science right now. And I think I'm going to have a pint as well. See you next time, guys.